Okay, I know what you're thinking. Carol, I'm sick of half square triangles. Yes, I am too. That's why I'm giving you a block that has 24 half square triangles in it. Anyway, the next block tomorrow will have not a single half square triangle, not a triangle at all. So I'm actively looking for blocks that do not have half square triangles. This block is called Flying Square. Everywhere on the internet when I saw this block, it was called Winged Square, W-I-N-G-E-D. But that's too hard for me to say, so I changed the name to Flying Square. So it's not a winged square, it's a flying square. Here is the diagram and all these triangles are the A patches and the three squares are B patches. That just makes it a little bit easier. Now these half square triangles are really an assortment of colors so I don't know if you want to use the eight at a time method because it really looks very striking when you have colors taken out of the main fabric in the center and you have an assortment of different colors in that color family. But anyway, you can use the two at a time method to make your half square triangles or even your eight at a time if you want to have the squares looking more the same. So here is the cutting chart, half square triangles, and then the squares, the large squares. I chose colors out of the yellow-orange family and then the blue and aqua family to put in with this block. And now we'll just make all the half square triangles and then we'll arrange them in a pleasing look on the board. This is really an interesting block. I don't know if I would ever make an entire quilt out of this block, but I just like the way it looks. And it's your chance to showcase a really pretty fabric that you like, even though it's only a four inch square. What I did with the blue fabric, I started with the dark in the outside corner and went to light. And then with the yellow, orange, gold fabrics, I started with the dark and went to the light. I laid it out and now I'll just sew it together and show you what it looks like. Here is the block and it's really pretty. I really do like this block. It's unusual and it's nice and colorful and it shows off a really nice print in the center. the bag.